YouTube, it's your girl in the day, and I'm back with another video. So as y'all can tell by that title, today's video is going to be another Q&A. So I decided to do these weekly while I would try. Because a lot of people be having a lot of questions. Some of them be the same, some of them be a little different. And it be a lot of them be good ones. So so y'all can know, like, keep y'all can be updated on me and my life and everything. I guess I'll try doing these weekly. Hopefully y'all can watch them and y'all like them. But let me know if y'all want to see anything else. Y'all can comment below or y'all can text my social media or whatever. But give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Go check out all my other videos. And y'all need to go hit that subscribe button and join the family. Because what you waiting on. But anyways, let's get straight into this Q&A. Y'all, yeah, so I'm going to look at my binder once again. And to I get something extra to be on. But the first question is, who did you tell first? I'm talking about who did I tell I was pregnant first? Um, I'm trying to think. Like, who did I tell first? If I'm not mistaken, it had to be my best friend. That's who I think I told first because me and my baby father found out the same day. So, he don't really count as me telling him first. But, like, a, and then someone else, it had to be my best friend, if I'm not mistaken. Because I think she was with me when I got the test. Yeah. It had to be. I am so sorry I got interrupted. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Um. Question number two. What part hurt the worst during labor? What part hurt the worst? When you in labor, I mean contractions. When you in labor, yes, contractions would hurt. It's like some real strong cramps that don't go away. It's like you ease off a little bit and it just hit real, real hard. That's the worst. And if you say I don't hurt, then you tripping because that mess hurt. Um, question number three. What is your plan after high school? My plan after high school. Um, well, you know, a lot of stuff changing. My mind still is just like my mind still trying to see. I'm really trying to see still I wanna do. But I know for sure, like I wanna take this YouTube like I wanna take it. I want to take it somewhere. I want to go somewhere with it. I know that for a fact. Another thing, I really been working on trying to get my last stuff. You know, that's gonna be coming soon. But I'm taking my time, I'm not rushing the pro the process. Cause when it come, it's gonna be good and it's gonna be real good. So I know I wanna. Really, I'm trying to work on have my own business. Cause I don't wanna work for nobody. I mean, if I have to, I will. But. Mm -mm. I like to be the boss. I don't want to work for nobody. So, I'm really trying to work on my business at the high school. You know, get myself together. I do want to go to college. I might go to the college, like, not too far because, you know, I got to think about my baby. But I still think, think I still want to go to college. So, it's still, you know, I got not much time to think. But I pretty much got my mind made if I want to get my business together. Um, Question number four. Who do you look up to? Okay, someone that I look up to. Really, if I'm in honest, I say this all the time. Like, I look up to my Amy. Like, that's my best friend. That's my best friend. I look up to my Amy. Like, she's somebody that I look up to. It's like, the way she carry herself, the way she speak. It's like a lot of stuff that I look up to her. Like, that's my go-to person, too. That's why I get my advice for Like, well, if I'm in a situation, I will call her to, like, see what I should do. Because she always know what, you know, she know what the right stuff to do. Because if I act on my own. <laughs> yeah. I forgot what number I'm on. I think I'm on question number five. But question five, do you want more kids? Yes, I do. Well, I be thinking. Because sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Because I always had one in six kids. But after I had this first one. Them six is out of my mind. They gone. I don't want them. I want probably two kids. Because I want Chase to be lonely growing up. Like, I want him to have somebody to play with. But I'm not thinking about having them right now. When Chase turn about five or something. I don't know. Not right now, though. Yeah, but, yeah, I want one more. I want another boy. I want boys. Because I already got their names. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I already got their names. So, that's going to be really good. Um, question number six. What do you love most about being a teen mom? What I love most about being a teen mom. A teen mom. Um, uh, really, me being a teen mom, I like the fact that 
it matured me a lot to be honest and it changed my whole mindset about a lot of things it helped me think bigger you know I don't know. It, I just want more for myself so my baby can have a better life. And um, I love to see my baby grow, like, daily. It's so crazy because since he came out, like, I ain't, I be looking at him like, at first you was not doing this. You wasn't making this sound. You wasn't kicking. You wasn't moving. You wasn't spitting. You didn't, like, and just knowing that he know my face, like, and know who I am. That is amazing. I just love it so much. It's like seeing him grow, like, I don't know. It's real like seeing him grow up i really loved it see like what he do different stuff every probably every week he changed like he doing he doing different stuff that it's something he did last week that he doing this week so i love to see my baby grow um question number seven i think how was it after you had the baby well she added like him like she asking like with the walk in like my body okay so after i had the baby um after i had chase like right after i had chase when i say i couldn't move because you have to take a bath right after after you do skin and skin and snack and after that baby when i said in that tub i was in pain i was in there crying i couldn't walk i had to get in the wheelchair like it hurt bad 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 like down there is so sore because he tore me and it hurt i'm telling y'all like it's no that mess hurt i was like mm -mm, baby it hurt she also asked did you bleed yes you going you going to bleed for a little minute um if i'm not mistaken you bleed about three weeks or more probably a whole six weeks it depends on your body but yeah you going to bleed now after you had him you gonna bleed a lot you might have to wear like a diaper or something because i know when i was in the hospital i had like a little diaper thing on because you're going to bleed a lot like you bleed a lot um question number eight i'll answer those i answer this one okay i wasn't gonna answer this because i don't really know like it said what's one thing you regret about becoming a team mom um i mean it wasn't planned to become a team mom i can't just say i regret it's like I don't really regret nothing. It's more so it's a blessing. Like, everything happened for a reason. I mean, God had put this baby in my life for no reason. So, I don't really regret none of it, to be honest. If I'm, if I'm being honest, I don't regret none of it. At all. I don't. Like, I'm happy that I got my baby. Because I love him so much. Just like me saying I regret him. I don't regret nothing. Mm -hmm. Um, Question number eight nine i don't know what would you do differently okay so i'm gonna take this as they saying like what would, what would i do different i don't know i'm gonna answer it in two different ways okay so what would i do differently when when it comes to my child all right you know when you become a mom you don't have it it's you don't have it pl like oh my you you don't even know your child personality i don't know because I know what type of person I want him to be. I don't want him to be no thug running around here with his pants, talking back, disrespecting because disrespect me. <sighs> Lord, I know I want my child to be like me at all because I have a real smart mouth. I know I do. My attitude is really, really bad. And I really believe his attitude going to be bad, but... He gonna know who to play with. Like, I don't want my child to be disrespectful. Like, all that. Even though he a boy, I want to feel like he got to run. I want to be yes man. I want him to be a gentleman. Like, I'm gonna do that different. Like, I'm gonna be different from, you know, people, other parents. I ain't saying, I'm not saying they bad parents. But I know, I know what I want to do and what I don't want to do. What type of parent I want to be or what type of parent I don't want to be. How I want to raise my son or how I don't want to raise my son. So, I'm gonna do a lot of stuff different when it comes to him. When it comes to me being a mama too understanding me right now because this question was just like what would you do differently like what 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 you like i don't understand exactly what you what you want me to say what i would do differently so i'm saying how i'm do how i'm be different with me dealing with my baby that's that's the best thing i say because my page is about teen mom but i'm gonna add different stuff to it. it's not all about that but it's what it's mainly about so i'm i'm gonna just assume you're asking about when it comes to chase so i'm just answer it like that or whatever um that's pretty much it i don't see any other questions
Yeah, this is all the ones I had wrote down because I said I'm doing these weekly, so I want to just keep, you know, writing all the questions down. This is not really, I just, I was like, man, I got to record because I'm really running out of ideas. Like, we in this house, I'm tired of sitting down making videos. I'm ready to get out and get out the house. That's why I'm ready for my birthday. Like, I'm ready to get out and keep it moving. Like, just sitting down making videos. That is so boring. But I really thank y'all for watching my videos. Because my views are going up and I'm loving My subscribers are going up and I'm loving it. So, a good thing I'm going to be done with this video because Shay just woke up. But make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Go watch all my other videos. Press that um subscribe button. Y'all yeah, need to go and press it. Join the family. So give this video a thumbs up once again. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we out.